Merci, Monsieur le Président. Uh, I'm sorry to have arrived late. I had a lot of problems to travel to Brussels today. Uh, I would like to put the following question. Uh, for the last decade, at least, the European Union budget uh, has not been spent in its entirety at the end of each financial year. Between 10 to 15 percent remains unspent. And although this is portrayed as a result of complex regulation, in my view, uh, it appears to indicate that there is not enough analysis and consultation put into place for the preparation of the budget. I think the requests need to come from the member countries and uh, the fact that there is complex regulation should not affect uh, the proper process of planning. So the first thing I would like to ask you is how do you plan to organize the budgeting and programming uh, work for the coming years? And uh, the second question uh, I would like to put is uh, what do you think about the European Parliament having the power to increase the level of expenditure in different lines? Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Lewandowski. Uh, thank you. Uh, where are, uh, where are two uh, different issues. One is about uh, uh, commitments that rest are liquid, that is in the nature of, uh, of financial programming, uh, that is in the nature of having on one side uh, payments going beyond financial perspective and, uh, and on the other side uh, commitments. Uh, so there is uh, a huge amount of outstanding commitments, more than 150 billion euro, and what is possible is manageable level, manageable link between, between uh, payments and commitments, because a uh, gap is always and will be always uh, present. And second issue is about unspent money, that is the committed uh, commitments, uh, that is as I have told uh, already, that is the fiasco of a policy. If, the, if uh, there is not just an error, because this is another issue, but the, the committed part of money, uh, that is the fiasco of, of, of policy that was equipped with this money and not delivered simply. Uh, how to, uh, the issue is very well known and on many occasions discussed in the Parliament, in the Commission, in the Council, uh, whether this, the only solution is the revision of financial uh, regulation making it easier. Uh, you, you should know, uh, I think, uh, better than me, because this is the, the very complex issue of how to modernize financial regulation to have less of, uh, of unspent uh, money and less of red tape. As to the programming, it should be rather on the same lines, I think, in the coming future. What, what cannot be expected is annual policy strategy this year because the college, the college is coming very late to action. So this is what, what, uh, we, are, what we cannot expect. And normally the, draft, the preliminary draft budget uh, was preceded by the annual policy strategy. I am not sure, but it seems that this time we are too late to make annual policy strategy. That is the beginning of a cycle of, of, of programming. Merci. Madame Andreasen. Thank you, Mr. Andreasen. No follow-up. The second part of the question was, what do you think about the European Parliament inc increasing certain lines? Merci. The Parliament is growing in powers that is full co-decision and what is, what is now called the ordinary legislative uh, procedure, uh, but not that powerful to unilaterally change the budget. It needs consent of the two arms of a budgetary authority, and this is always easier to find a place in the Parliament for increases, for, uh, for equipping policies with money, than on the side of council, on many occasions uh, uh, represented by the finance ministers, and they have, they have their own calculation. 
because they are responsible for national contribution and the money are going to the region. So the calculation from the point of view of our finance minister is looking completely differently than the overall flow of money between Brussels and the relevant region or, or country. But this is beyond the powers of the parliament, even if with, with a new treaty to, to go ahead with unilateral modifications. <laughs>